Okay, real quick, I'm going to show you how I changed the color of her gown here from this gold to blue. So you start with Control or Command J to duplicate this initial layer. And then once you have that, you want to create a layer mask. And that's this little icon down here at the bottom of your layers with the circle in the rectangle. Okay, and then you want an adjustment layer, which if you have your adjustments tab open, it's right in with all these. You can find those in window adjustments if it's not av available to you. You want the hue saturation. And we want this to affect only this layer that we're going to mask off. So this little icon right here links it to that one. You can also hit the Alt or Option key and that will show up if you hover between the layers right here. So that links it in between those two layers that way. And then it's just a simple matter of sliding this over until you get the blue color you want for the gown. I pulled the saturation down just a little bit. Somewhere in there I think. And then going back and masking all that off with a black paintbrush. You use a fairly hard edged one because we want to be pretty precise with these edges. Or you could hit Control Command I and just switch that mask to black and paint with white to reveal a hard edge brush to reveal that. So you basically just go through and bring out what you want to be that color. Okay, so that's really all there was to it. Um, I'm not going to show the whole thing of going through, but it's just a matter of, you know, in the detail areas, like here, just using a smaller brush and pulling through to get that color in where you want. And if you don't have a drawing tablet, one would very much help, like a Wacom or Hyon pen tablet for editing. That helps tremendously doing this kind of work.